Hi everyone, today I'm going to be doing an alcohol ink painting and at the end I'm going to be covering it with resin and gold leaf. So here you can see I'm just playing around with some alcohol inks on a birch panel and spreading it around with my heat gun trying to make some cool effects. Now I'm going to mix up some Artworks resin to pour over it. First you're going to need a respirator mask and some gloves. Then you're going to take part A and pour it into a Dixie cup with some lines because you're going to need part B also. And you're going to pour that in, making sure you get equal parts. Mix them together in a cup for approximately four to five minutes, stirring very well. Make sure you scrape the bottom and the sides. And then I'm just going to pour it all over the painting, spreading it around with my gloves, making sure I get it all evenly coated. Now I'm just going to get out my propane torch and just quickly moving it fast, go over it to pop any air bubbles, uh, making sure not to keep it in the same spot for very long, otherwise you will burn the resin. Now I'm going to mix up some resin with some white pigment in it that I'm going to just drizzle with my popsicle stick over the top in whatever shape I think would look good. Now I'm just going to take my heat gun and hold it over the white for a few seconds until it starts to blow out. And what that does is it just gives it that frothy wave looking appearance. Now I'm going to take my butane torch and if you just hold it over the white for a few seconds it makes it split into these really cool looking cells. Now I'm just going to take some gold leaf flakes and just put some in the corner here.
now I'm just gonna take these purple tinted quartz points and just lay them across just to make like a little design. And here's what it looks like up close. Now I'm just taking some of this gold leafing glue and just trying to visualize where I'm going to add my lines. Now I'm gonna take some pinata gold alcohol ink and I'm just gonna paint along the edge of the quartz points. And I'm just going to take some of this gold leafing and put it on top of where I added the glue and you just rub it on, wait for it to dry and then you just get a fluffy paintbrush and wipe off the excess.
And that's it, it's all done. What do you think? I just love adding resin to all of my artwork. It gives it depth and dimension and a really shiny finish. Uh, this Artworks resin is really great. You can buy it at thecraftattack.com.